A new government report on UFOs was released, and the bottom line, there, ex there exists no worldly explanation as to a number of episodes. The unclassified government report on UFOs hot off the presses. It says preliminary assessment, preliminary assessment, and it's clearly preliminary. The government concentrated its review on 144 reports of unidentified aerial phenomena since 2004. Oh my gosh. Of those, 143 remain unexplained. The other 143, what are they? They don't know. They could be anything. Dr. Seth Shostak is a senior astronomer at the SETI Institute in Mountain View. They did not rule out anything in any category, and that means they didn't rule out what's called atmospheric clutter, you know, just things in our airspace. They didn't rule out you know, Russian or, or Chinese vehicles. They didn't rule out alien vehicles. They, 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 they just couldn't say. 21 of the reports possibly demonstrate technological capabilities unknown to the U.S. The most interesting thing to me was that they said these are, at least some of them, are real physical objects. The report notes these unidentified objects threaten flight safety and may pose a challenge to U.S. national security. It concludes that the U.S. government needs to invest in better ways to collect and analyze these reports. Shostak is not overly concerned. I don't see anything in this report that's going to discourage me from getting on a commercial airline this weekend and flying somewhere. I don't think we're going to hit uh, you know, a Klingon craft. So you're right. I think it just leaves everything exactly where it was. So what's next? Well, the government plans on updating federal lawmakers within 90 days on plans to improve collecting data and how they will better observe the phenomena.